Common Core Content Standard 2.OA.A.1. Use addition and subtraction within 100 to solve one and two step word problems involving situations of adding to, taking from, putting together, taking apart, and comparing with unknowns in all positions by using drawings and equations with a symbol for the unknown number to represent the problem. There are many parts to this standard. Word problems, addition and subtraction, multiple step problems, problems where the answer is not just the sum or the difference, but the answer could be within the problem, and solving problems with both standard math equations and drawings. Here's an example of a one-step word problem. James's class has an ice cream party. He watches his teacher serve 11 ice cream cones. There are 19 students in James's class. How many more ice cream cones does his teacher need to serve? Students should be taught that the words how many more usually goes with subtraction. Here's a number sentence that contains the facts from the problem. 11 ice cream cones served plus the number of ice cream cones that still need to be served equals the 19 students that are in James's class. Using related equations, also called fact families, students should be able to change the equation 11 plus some number equals 19 into 19 minus 11 equals some number. Here we have a picture showing our problem. Students are often asked to draw a picture in order to solve the problem. In this case, a student needs to draw in the eight additional ice cream cones it takes to solve this problem. Here's an example of a two-step problem that is similar to the one-step problem we just did. James's class has an ice cream party. There are 19 students in James's class. He watches his teacher make 11 ice cream cones. Three ice cream cones melt. How many more ice cream cones does his teacher need to make for each student to get an ice cream? So here's our standard equation problem. 11 ice cream cones minus the three ice cream cones that melted plus some number equals 19, which is the number of students that need to get ice cream in James's class. First, we will complete the subtraction problem, 11 minus 3. 11 minus 3 equals 8. Next, now we have the number 8. So 8 plus some number will equal 19. We can solve this problem by using fact families, also called related equations. 8 plus some number equals 19. Some number plus 8 equals 19. 19 minus this number equals 8. And 19 minus 8 equals our number. Out of these four equations, it is easy to see that 19 minus 8 will give us our answer, which is 11. Mastering these types of word problems takes lots of practice. It's a good idea to make additional word problems for our students to practice. Once students start to understand how to complete word problems, have them create word problems for others to solve. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and visit techteacherzone.com.